G'day guys. Uh, well, it's been a while since I've done my last video, especially anything related to Star Wars, but uh, I've moved to the new home and uh, I just want to share it with you, um, how I've got my collection displayed. Uh, so this part here is me, my desk. Uh, most of my other Star Wars stuff is out in the main uh, lounge room and obviously most of it's all stored away, but we'll go through and uh, we'll talk about what's what's happening all right so i've been at the new house for probably uh probably two months now as you can see there's no star wars on the computer desk uh, i've got me uh prime studio no not prime studios i can't remember iron studios uh, i've got clever girl statue from jurassic park got my uh, war machine and i've picked up the uh, Hammond collection T-Rex and Triceratops. These things look absolutely awesome. So I love the Jurassic World uh, Park franchise and uh, these the T-Rex is absolutely awesome. And then obviously my trusty Stormtrooper helmet with my Hot Toys Stormtroopers. And these ones are Sideshow. Uh, 12 inch figures and then I've got my black series uh, started collecting the uh, leader class dino bots some massive uh, transformers fans from the 80s so I uh, can't wait to when they eventually release swoop but yeah I love the dinosaur dino, uh, dino bots bit of a, a dinosaur fan when I grew up as a kid and uh, they uh, my favourite Transformers. And then got the movie studio uh, Decepticons from the first Transformer film. I don't want to get into tr collecting Transformers as much. I just want to, um, especially for the movie line, I want to get the first lot of Decepticons. So I need Bone Crusher and Barricade, and they're finished. And that's all I'm going to do for the movie line. And then I've got the Godzillas. That me and my son and I uh, collect the NECA ones. Unfortunately, NECA don't um, <clears throat> make the Godzillas anymore. So I've only got the one glass cabinet now. The other glass cabinet is still at the other house. Um, not too sure what I'm going, what I'm going to do with that. If I'm going to bring it back here, I maybe could put it there, but it's just going to look stupid. So unfortunately I've just got the one case and then I've got me Predator helmet down here, mask, which is freaking sick. But yeah, so this is the new area where I do all my, uh, do what I do. And then I'll, I'll, I'll go have a look where the main Star Wars is displayed. Well actually, I'll show you where I store all my carded figures and that at the moment. I've got to sort them out. <clears throat> so I've got all my carded vintage collection figures are in there. They're able to pretty much, I can store all, all of them in there. So, and carded a few of the 80s Transformers there. Got the Alien. So it's pretty cool. I can pretty much put all my carded stuff in these cupboards. Just need to sort them out a bit better though. And most of the ships I've got are out in the shed. So, all right, so this is where I've got pretty much most of my Star Wars stuff. Um, obviously it's not all of it, but uh, my 12 inch sideshow and my Black Series. Now I've got heaps of figures, as you would know. This is just where I'm putting stuff at the moment. I'm probably going to change some things around. I can get some of my collection a bit more in there, but. There we have it. It's good to get these guys out again. They've been packed away for, for quite a while. I'm going to probably change some stuff around. Just probably display what I what I like. You guys 
just down there. But yeah, I would love to be able to display all my collection, but I just can't, can't do it. Just don't have the space. And <clears throat> I would like love to do the shed, have everything displayed out there, but you know, that's the last priority at the moment. So, um, I'm trying to sell the other house yet and then sort this one out and yeah, so I was probably thinking, because I just hate um, my Star Wars collection just sitting in boxes in a shed, especially coming up the summer as well. And I might have to probably start looking at selling it and just condense it right down and just only collect or only have what I, I really like. But yeah, so there it is, my collection. I don't really collect too much these days. Um, every now and then, I think the latest was the uh, Endor Trooper I picked up. It's pretty cool, I wanna get another one. But yeah, that's all I've been doing. Um, I'm probably really cut down on the collecting side of it. It's just it's becoming way too expensive and I just can't justify spending the money. So I do every now and then pick something up that I like. And I've, I've said in the past that if I'm going to collect anything, it's going to be something that's related to the original tr trilogy um, or something that as a, when I was a kid that I liked a lot. And that's why I've, I've picked up the uh, Dino Bots which I'm just going to stop there. Um, I'm just going to get, uh, hopefully, when they release Swoop. And probably some of the 80s um, Transformers <clears throat> from the first cartoons, just pick up a few of those characters. That's it. And, you know, just original trilogy stuff. Uh, Blacks, probably in the Black series, the vintage collection. Yeah, I'll probably stop doing that as well. But I'm also going to probably look at start selling some of the collection as well at some stage. But yeah. So, alright guys. Um, <clears throat> um, thanks for checking this video out. Hopefully I'll, I'll do some videos. It just really depends on how busy I am. Um, this time, <clears throat> well, freaking hell, the last probably... 14 months have been absolutely really busy for me, especially for work, um, <clears throat> change of career and stuff, and a lot of study pretty much last year. The whole, whole of 2022 was pretty busy with study for me. That finished all the way up until uh, end of last year. Start of this year, I had a fair bit of more stuff I had to complete, and at the moment, just, yeah, just chilling and uh, looking at what, what I can do in the future and that. So, but yeah, <clears throat> there's the collection. I'm going to probably sort this out a bit better and come back with an update on how I've got stuff displayed. I'd love to get a few, probably a couple ships in here as well. I might condense some of these 12 inch figures down and only display that what I want in here and you know, so I can have some of my ships in here. Yeah, but anyway, I'll do an update video on that uh, down the track. Now, when it comes to reviews, I don't think I'll do reviews anymore. That's probably it. Uh, yeah, no more reviews on Star Wars, but I'd, I'd love to continue sharing my collection and stuff and just showing that, but yeah. But anyway, I've talked enough. Uh, <clears throat> just getting over a cold thanks for tuning in please drop a comment down below let me know how you're going and uh, hit this like and if you're new to this channel please subscribe unfortunately my original star wars channel is on on the other channel i don't really show those videos anymore this is the the newest of the channels and um, yeah go check out the other, other videos and that as well of my collection all right guys thanks for watching and may the force be with you always